Donald Trump's longtime personal attorney and self-described fixer, Michael Cohen, is set to testify before the democratically led House for three days. The president appears to be very worried about what Cohen has to say, and he should be. After all, the fixer knows the president's darkest secrets. Reportedly, Cohen will testify under oath and before the public that POTUS was criminally active even after he took office. When the judge sentenced Cohen, Trump tweeted, throwing his longtime employee under the bus. I never directed Michael Cohen to break the law. He was a lawyer and he is supposed to know the law. It is called advice of counsel, and a lawyer has great liability if a mistake is made. That is why they get paid. The attorney, who has been scheduled to go to prison in two months, will provide evidence to the House Committee on Oversight and Reform about the criminal activity. Cohen will tell the committee that POTUS paid him $35,000 a month to make Trump's hush money payments to adult entertainment actor and director Stormy Daniels immediately before the 2016 presidential election. She alleged that she had an affair with the president just months after Melania gave birth to their son. In fact, Cohen will go into granular detail about Trump's involvement in the criminal activity. The personal attorney pled guilty to federal campaign finance charges and lying to Congress in 2017 about the dates around the president's Moscow Trump Tower plan. The prosecutors identified Trump as individual one in the documents filed in Cohen's case. In addition, the attorney accused the commander-in-chief of making racist statements and lying cheating in business. Cohen reported that during the presidential campaign Trump said, according to the New York Times, Black people are too stupid to vote for me. Cohen also claimed that the man currently sitting in the Oval Office inflated and devalued his net worth depending up whether he was doing his taxes or a real estate deal. As a result of Cohen's testimony, Trump has called his former employee a rat and a weak person. The president has been trying to discredit Cohen, claiming he was testifying to get a softer sentence. Mueller's investigators interviewed Cohen for over 70 hours. The special counsel has been investigating Russia's attack on the 2016 presidential campaign and the Trump campaign's conspiracy with Moscow. Cohen has also worked with Southern District of New York, SDNY, investigators too. Although, Mueller's people agreed that the information Cohen provided was accurate and very helpful, the SDNY was not satisfied that the attorney had confessed to every single crime he or his family or friends committee. The result was a three-year sentence. Cohen will testify behind closed doors with the Senate Intelligence Committee. Then on Wednesday, he will testify openly before the Oversight Committee. Republicans will probably join the president in attacking Cohen's credibility. They will point out that he lied before Congress previously. Perhaps Trump planned his trip to Vietnam to meet with North Korean dictator Kim Jong-un to take some of the attention away from Cohen's testimony.